say hello guys Jay to Christy need that hey guys I'm Christy so um, I'm going to be doing a review to love rain as you can tell I was kind of sick uh, last week which is why I didn't do the video my dog um, so I'm going to be uh, doing the review right now so the drama that I saw is love rain it is very a very interesting drama it's very good um, so I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the drama okay we um, start off in the 1970s and there's a whole bunch of, well, there's not a whole bunch of characters, there's like maybe six characters that we're going to focus on. Um, the first character is So In Ha. He is an artist, he's a painter, he does um, a lot of landscape kind of artistry. Um, <clears throat> and he's kind of focused on his art. He has a group of friends that he hangs out with. Um, Lee Dong Wook is one of is it like his best friend, his all-time best friend. Um, Kim Chang Mo is his other friend. He is kind of like an activist. It's kind of I think it's it's I'm so ashamed that I don't really know the history of, of Korea and the split between North and South Korea. But I'm thinking this is kind of happening at about that time. Um, there's a curfew that's enacted, um, that, that, that's enforced. Um, and there's a lot of music or songs that can't be sung um, because they're considered rebellious. Uh, and you actually go to prison for it. And um, Kim Chang Mo is, he's that kind of, he's that kind of person. He's a rebellious kind of person. He, he's uh, more like, you know, I think um, he'd be considered like an activist. Um, okay, uh, well, at least that's how I see it. He's, he's an activist kind of person. You have Park Hye Jung. Um, she is a one of the girls. There's two girls in the group. She's the first girl. She is in love with So In Ha. But So In Ha, you know, he's kind of like, yeah, okay. All right, he doesn't really, he's not really into her, but he's not really like discouraging her. It's kind of like an understanding that they're going to be going out, kind of. And then you have not in so. Na In Suk is in love with Kim Chang Mo. She's a really cute person to kind of watch throughout the this whole this process. Um. Now, um, like I said, So In Ha is kind of, an, he's an artist, and uh, <clears throat> I mean like a painter artist, and he's really focusing on his, on his art, he's not really doing anything else. He hangs out with his friends, but really his focus is his art. Um, until one day, he's passing this, he's, he's walking and he passes this girl, like they just kind of walk by each other, and it, it in the three seconds that it takes to pass her, he falls in love with her. When he's waiting at a bus stop, um, he has a cut on his finger. Uh, Kim Dong Wong, Lee Dong Wong, he has a cut on his finger, and this girl tells him, "Hey, you're bleeding," and he's like, "Oh yeah, thanks." And she offers him a band-aid, but he kind of has his hands full, so um, she puts it off for him. And in those three seconds that it takes to put on the band-aid, he falls in love with her. So In Ha finds out that it's the same girl that he's in love with. Her name is Kim Yun Hee. She, um, she's kind of quiet, she's kind of meek. She doesn't really cause a lot of ruckus. She's kind of shy and introverted. And she has this diary that she kind of puts everything in. The whole, like, I guess theme behind this section of this of this drama, the 1970s portion of it, is um, love story. <clears throat> you know that whole concept, or that, that line, that fam infamous line from Love Story. You know. It's kind of what she's after. Now everybody has these notions of love. Well, that particular line. That particular, this particular story, maybe that's her, her goal, I guess. 
her aspiration. It's a better word for it, aspiration. Inevitably, they kind of fall in love with each other. He doesn't go pursuing it, she doesn't go pursuing it, but it kind of happens. Um, flash forward 30 years later. So in her... Is... Professor. He's an art professor. <clears throat> He's an artist, you know, well-renowned, lots of work, and, you know, very famous. And he marries Pakia Jones. Um, they have a son, so Um, he's kind of a jerk, and he doesn't really believe in love. Um, <clears throat> he is a photographer, professional. Um, like he actually has work in magazines, and people actually call him to like, take pictures. And he's very, very good. He's got an eye for you know artistic detail. Kind of like your dad. Uh, while his dad <clears throat> kind of made it known that he fell in love in three seconds, so Jun is known as the three second seducer because when he meets a girl. He tells her exactly what she wants to hear, and he ends up in bed. And so he has a reputation. On the train, he kind of runs into, and I mean like, runs into, um, a girl. She turns out to look at him and she apologizes. In Japanese, it's pretty right, okay? <clears throat> and she kind of runs off. Well. She dropped her phone and he has her phone. And when she notices, she keeps calling her phone and she keeps making arrangements to pick it up. But he is kind of a jerk and he never really honors these arrangements. Either he goes and he does something else or you know, he's out with a girl or he's off with his friends. So she kind of gets fed up. She goes to the hotel room and they have a confrontation. And it's kind of the, the beginning of this... <clears throat> Of this new love story so what you find out is that her she um young hana her name is young hana she is when he's daughter you kind of see that they're destined to be the to be together sojun and and hana because of who their parents are. It's obvious that their parents cannot be together, so now Destiny's kind of like, okay, here's a second chance, and here you go. <clears throat> um, Yeonhee is back. She's in Korea, and she is a, a gardener, and she's kind of instilled this love of gardening in her daughter, and her daughter is an awesome gardener too. Of course, as it has to happen, Soinha finds out that Yunhee is back. They kind of pass each other by deja vu. Um, and he kind of notices, like, it takes him about two seconds to realize who she is. And he's kind of pursuing her, um, trying to make sure he knows who she is. And he's kind of stuck in that time frame. Like, he. he Time has moved on, but his heart really hasn't. Um, she is a person for him, and that's all there is to it. Like he married somebody else, but not because he loved her. He just married somebody else. Um, okay. The problem is, is that Sojun knows about his dad's 30-year obsession with his first love, and he's kind of resentful. And you kind of see throughout the drama, like you have trying to meant things with Sojun, but he's like not really having it. Well, Sojun and Yuha fall in love. They start dating. Um, but it's really cute. Like the love story between um, Hana and Sojun is adorable. And it blooms into something really beautiful. But of course, as this, you know, love story is starting to bloom, Inha decides that he is going to pursue he. I think what makes this show really good is the, the kind of the diversity that these actors have. Jung Kyuk Sok plays 
both in high in the 70s and Soju. And the differences in their personalities are so huge that it's amazing that he can kind of play both roles convincingly. Yuna from Girls' Generation plays Yeonhee when she's young and Hana. And it's really kind of, I mean, it's amazing because their two personalities are very different. Yunhee's kind of, you know, she's shy and she's introverted and she's more like meek and quiet. And Hannah's more like in your face and she's more, um, <clears throat> she's fun and she's outgoing and the complete opposite of, of Yunhee. Um, the other two who have dual roles is Lee Dong Wok Sun. Um, Lee-hun, Lee-sun-ho who is a doctor but he also manages a cafe or he owns a cafe um, he's kind of an on-call doctor like he kind of yeah like an on-call doctor like he um, he kind of goes to his patients instead of having his patients come to him um, the other person who has a dual role is Chang Mong, uh, Kim Chang Mong. Um, Kim Jun Sul is Chang Mong's nephew. And he kind of comes to Seoul. Um, but his personality is a lot like, like Kim Chang Mong. This whole situation with So Jun and Hana kind of, <clears throat> it kind of drags a little bit. It's several, several episodes in the middle where they're kind of broken up and crying. Next drama that I will be reviewing is which, uh, Mary Sit Out All Night, which is another Jen Kyung Suk um, drama. Um, Alright guys, well, uh, let me know. What you guys think? If you have anything that you want me to watch, if you have any suggestions for me, leave them down in the comments below. In the comments below, and hopefully, hopefully, I'll see you guys next Monday. Annyeong.